It's another K-Town beat. YouTube, 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 YouTube. It's your boy, Mr. Outliner, and I'm back. And today, I got a new hair fiber for y'all to use. It's called Bromane. Bromane. I kind of like, you know, digging the logo, you know, digging the, the packaging. It's cool, you know, like Bromane. You know, maybe I'm saying it right, maybe I'm saying it wrong. But anyway, so you got your 10% off coupon right here, and I'll leave a code that goes with code right there if you need it. But I'll leave a code in the description and you can get a discount that way too. Now, so what's in the box? You get the discount code. They even send a mirror. That's different. So I really like this part of it because if you want to be able to use it with your, on yourself on the go, you can always use a mirror. That's, that's neat to me. So I'm already liking the packaging, right? They give you a towel right here, right? This is a towel. You can use it for various things, you know, uh, to clean up, you know, he'll clean off the mirror, whatever. Lay your uh, your tools, your supplies on top of this. The thing that would have set this towel off is we would have had the Bro Main logo on it. Man, you need a Bro Main logo on that thing. That right there, it would have set it all the way off. But, you know, maybe they went conservative and didn't want to do all that. I get it, right? They could have put it in the corner, though. Right, so right here, what do we have? Uh, this is a box that comes inside of it also. And what this really is, this is the atomizer part. The part that you would use like the top to pump the hair fibers out of the dispenser. Whatever dispenser you use, and I'll show you what I use in a little bit, right? So this is the top. You see the top, it has a connection right here. And then I'll show you how to connect it real quick. So you, this is the pump part, and then you have the nozzle. So this is the pump, this is the nozzle. It's an easy uh, attachment, easy insert. Just uh, stick it in until you hear it snap, right? It snaps in, boom, you can pull that top off. And this is where the hair fibers disperse. Now, after that, what's left in the box we have the actual hair fiber itself and this is a black hair fiber they have other different colors also so you don't have to just go with black but a lot of times i use black so um that's what i i got right so right here uh let's open up the box let's see what we got right here so again uh nice packaging i like the black and gold uh, it helps to stand out you see that so uh, I'm not sure exactly what size bottle this is I didn't I didn't pay attention to it when I uh, opened it but right here you can take the top off and you see it has these little holes in the top of it right here and that's if you want to just sprinkle it like on a bald spot on top of the head if you just want to sprinkle it that's not the way that I use mine but you could use it that way you just shake it until the light spot until it fills up and you can see the hair fiber in there. I don't know if you can see it or not. But you just shake it right on top of the head, right? And it kind of gets a little messy for me with that. So I don't really like to use that. I'll use a pump. But this is a hair atomizer that I use. And I'll leave it in the description box too so you can know where you get it. But basically, you just take the hair fiber and you put it into this. Now, question is, why would I use this a hair atomizer? instead of the pump that it comes with the reason being for me with this hair atomizer you take the top and you just spin it back on the reason being for me with this hair atomizer it disperses evenly watch this and when you first get ready to use it after you feel it like that you want to squeeze it a few times just so you can get get that big lump spray out the way because normally when you put fiber in, when you get ready to first use it after you do that, it's going to spray like a, a big amount out. So get that first spray or two out and then it's ready to go. Now also, if you have the pump that you use that comes with it with them, you just put the pump on top of the um, hair fiber can, right? You just put the top on 
on top of that screw it on screws and you can use this also to disperse the hair fiber it's just the nozzle is a little wider so it's going to spray out more wide right instead of just kind of like directly where you want it it's not as controlled as it is with the hair itemizers that i use so again i can get the job done with that if you're going to use that you're going to have to pull it back further that's what i was trying to show you in the video you have to pull it back a little further because it's really going to spray and i'm going to give you a demonstration using the hair itemizer that i use and also using the hair itemizer that comes with it now if you haven't uh, if you're looking at it i already did a, a pre-line right because we want to keep it as natural as possible to his original line because after the hair fibers wear off this is what he's left with so make sure you do a, a pre-line in the beginning before you start using hair fibers now it doesn't come with a holding spray but you can get the mr outliner detailing mist and use it as a holding spray now what you want to do is take a card a business card or a postcard right and use it you spray the hair off the hair fiber off of the card onto the area where you want it to be now you see how i'm using this hair automizer and it's spraying perfectly for me right it's all about pressure also so pressure with your thumb and index finger right so here look you see i'm spraying it you see how it comes out it's direct exactly where i want it to be and it's even you see that like it makes it look look so natural right along with the hair fiber because a lot of hair fibers don't look natural if you don't use them right and these hair fibers they look right i can get them as you can see and if you spray a little bit too much you can take the end of a card or you can use uh the wide part of a comb and knock it off right but you see that right and we use the mr outline and detailing mist for the fibers to stick on to and then we use it again after we get the fibers on to lock it in even more so you're gonna have to have a, a holding a holding spray in order to make these fibers last longer the fibers did their job they are called hair building fibers because it builds up to make it look natural you just expanding on what's not there and creating it to make it look like it is there it's called enhancements right hair fiber enhancements and then once you do all that and you go over the same line that you did look how crispy that is they call me mr outliner for a reason baby. you know what i mean but you see how crispy that is right the hair fiber it looks natural right now that's one side this other side that i'm about to do this is the pump that comes with the hair fiber again you can use it i don't want to mislead anybody you can master this one too easily but i think you need to hold it back a little further you might have to go over it more than once because you see how it's spraying now right it's i have to go over it it's not filling in a little spot that i want i don't know why it does that but it always does that to me and you see how it is just not controllable right you see how thick it is compared to this side and then i'm missing hair in certain spots like it's hard to get this pump and it's not just this one it's a lot of those rubber pumps that you know like hold made rubber pumps in this a wide nozzle it's not gonna work good but you see me come back with the hair automizer that i use and boom it looks a lot better right and like i said you can take the end of a card you can wipe the excess off before you lock it in again before you line it up you can do that right before and you want to do it before you line it up you want to line it up and then you want to come back with your holding spray or before before you put the holding spray you want to make sure it's not too dark in certain areas now i got it on there boom i come back line them up again look at this this is looking so natural now i got one more haircut to show you that i did 
that I did it on. And it's a different type of haircut because he wasn't missing as much hair along the hairline as he was. Now I'm going to speed it up, slow it down on certain parts so you can see how the hair fiber is working. And then I'll let y'all go. Remember that I'm going to leave everything in the description box. You will get a discount code to use in order to get these hair fibers at a great price, right? But I wanted you to see exactly how I use hair fiber, right? In order to create a sharp look, crisp look. Y'all know what I do with these things, man. But um, this company really has a great product. I like to tell y'all about products that I use that works for me, right? So if you want to get this product, just make sure you look in my description box for the discount code to use. Now I'm gonna jump into the next haircut, but before that, uh, y'all know how we do, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, or tell a friend, you know how we do it. Until next time, love, peace, and hair grease.